and welcome to Homecoming 2013. I'm sorry I'm not in London to celebrate Ivy's 90 years of leadership with you, but when you view this, I will be retired. Carol may be leaving as Dean, but she will be part of our outstanding Ivy family, forever. Her years here are marked by many accomplishments, including this, our new home. Thanks, Anthony. Our new building is the perfect setting to honor the inspiring contributions of the four outstanding alumni and faculty to whom we pay tribute today. When I began my tenure as Dean of the Ivy Business School in 2003, I could not have imagined that together we would accomplish so much. But 10 years ago, I had not met these alumni or you. In 1998, the Ivy Alumni Association created the Ivy Distinguished Service Award and the Ivy Faculty Service Award to recognize those who have truly gone above and beyond in their support for so many of Ivy's achievements and accomplishments. Things like the completion of our award-winning new home, exceeding our goal in the $200 million campaign for leadership, or the solid growth of our programs and brand internationally. On every one of them, you'll find the powerful imprint of Ivy alumni. In a moment, you're going to learn a little more about our 2013 award recipients. From my perspective, I can tell you that working with these four dedicated individuals over the past 10 years has once again proven to me that Ivy is truly a rare community of people. People who not only share my passion for education, but who can be counted on to roll up their sleeves and get things done again and again. On behalf of Dean Bob Kennedy and Ivy's faculty, staff and students, and with my own deep personal thanks for the support over the years, congratulations to all of our 2013 Service Award recipients for their dedication, vision and inspiring contributions. And with that, we're proud to present our award recipients. Their message on being involved and giving back is evident in all of this year's achievements. Ivy is a unique institution in Canada. It's Canada's best business school. And if I'm gonna take time uh, to donate to something, I want it to matter. And I wanna help do my bit to keep Ivy the best school in Canada. Ever since I was a student, have always looked for ways that I could be involved in in uh, different you know, important communities in my life and be able to give back to them. And now Ivy has become that that priority for me. Giving back is important because we have a shared obligation. We have a custodianship that I think we need to take very seriously. And it's important for Ivy to be successful because that's important for Canada. The school needs to have a concept that our alumni are partners in the Ivy brand, are partners in the Ivy experience, and are a critical element in making Ivy successful. I chose to get involved with Ivy because I'm really um, appreciative of all the opportunities that Ivy afforded me with my career. When I was asked to get involved in, in uh, class reunions and class campaigns after graduation, it seemed like a natural fit. The energy that I get from the new grads and the new students who are thrilled to have the opportunity to speak with alumni is uh, empowering. And what it really reminds me of more than anything else is how important the two years I spent at Ivy were in, in my development. I'm privileged because I have a chance to help create future leaders, people who are going to make a difference. It's a group of, of very impressive, dynamic, successful people, but they're friendly, they're warm, they're supportive. And it's a group that I, I wouldn't have been part of if I hadn't actually put my hand up to say yes, I, I'm willing to give back. There's lots of opportunity if you stay involved with the school for continuous learning and taking advantage of all of the great knowledge and research that's happening at the school. We want to be lifelong learners and Ivy's a great place to be part of that. Part of my role is I'm also president of the Western men's rugby team. And my role there is not to coach rugby, but to mentor young men to be better young men, many of whom are Ivy, pre-Ivy, and prospective Ivy students. I've found that I've still had time to get involved in things like the Ride to Conquer Cancer. I still have time to get involved in supporting some of the artistic communities. By giving back to Ivy, 
you're actually benefiting all of those other things because you're helping create a more successful business community in Canada. For me, giving back to Ivy is really important because I think it's the best way that as alumni we can really uh, grow and sustain the reputation and, and capabilities of the school. Ultimately, if we want to keep our graduates competitive in this incredibly competitive world, we need to contribute to their experience and continue to make the Ivy experience special and unique. I don't think any one individual does one action, but what we do is we build, frankly, on the shoulders of giants, alumni, donors, staff, faculty who have come before us. Each one of us contributes towards enhancing that Ivy experience. Think back to your experience as a student at Ivy. Think about that inspirational person who came into the classroom. Think about that Ivy alumni event that you went to or that networking event. Think about that person who gave you a break as, a, as an Ivy alum. It's now time for you to take the baton and help the next generation of Ivy grads.